Can we take uh, the time to appreciate this amazing episode? Episode number, let me see which episode is. Uh, what the fuck, oh, pilot, I'm going crazy right now. Episode 1100. I think is uh, one of my favorite. After the Kaido fight, because in the Kaido fight, uh, there is so many beautiful and amazing episodes. I know what's happening with the player, is he went crazy. A Kaido going insane and angry with Lucci, because he's taking uh, uh, the initiative. But that's that's a fight we wanted to see. I'm actually happy to see uh, Lucci looks like this, uh, uh, this strong and cool. I watched the episode, so let's do. You can watch the episode, though, you want. This is the best part of the episode. The episode, the part where uh, Luffy is annoyed. Uh, and both of them. Lucci with his team, he doesn't care about them. He's got like this kind of ri rivalry with Lu Luffy. And Luffy just. Uh, I don't think he. I don't think he cares. He's annoyed because he punched the girl that gave them food. And you know how Luffy is with food. But this part is the base, amazing. I like this animation a lot. Everything. Best episode in a while. A really good uh, good timing for episode 1100. They both look really good, the animation looks good, everything is perfect. We have to say, when something is good, something is good. I wonder how they're going to draw and how they're going to animate when uh, Luffy fights Kizaru and then they... Oh! Oh! Sorry, spoilers. Mmm, yeah. Attention spoilers. So I gotta put in the title attention spoilers. Let's just enjoy the, this. Luci uh, doing these attacks and Luffy. I'm not sure if they both use Konkuraki. I don't think Luci's got Kong. I wouldn't be surprised if he's got like a Konkuraki. I actually would be like happy for him. I have like a dream of seeing Luci third side and because for him. Uh, for him, uh, I think uh, law and uh, order are the most important things, something like that. He wakes up and he knows uh, wh what the fuck is wrong with the world government and he turns around and he becomes uh, no straw at by becoming some, some kind of member of... Uh, ooh. The drama or liberation. Do, do. Joy boy. The power of a Yonko. Hey, it's so cool when uh, Luchi is like smiling and in the like zero point. Zero point zero one second Luffy gets his face ready to punch you with like red eyes of a crazy person. Joy boy. Until I don't know. It's been a week a year since the chapter where we find out that Luffy's Joy Boy. Before this guy, Joy Boy, Joy Boy, no one knew what he was, Joy Boy. And in the end, Luffy's Joy Boy. Because he's actually Joy Boy. He's like clumsy, funny, strong. But overall, he's dumb as fuck. And that's why we like him. Oh, this is cool, like, I love this like, animation. Boom! This part is amazing. This part when he sees like the reflection of Luffy in his eyes. And this part, salt, this part here where Luchi transforms into his awakened form is cool too.
Lauf, hey! And then we have Vega Vagal shocked it all by go the liberation liberal this is the best part. Luci transforming beautiful this is amazing design and heart Ta -da 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 -da. The flames because this is a zone type so all the zone type I guess have this kind of flames around <laughs> you are not the only one who got stronger Really cool. So we can see the Luch is like a, a skilled controller of this zone type. Luffy became Spider-Man. <laughs> this virtual chopper is what <laughs> it was a kung fu kung fu panda chopper. Then we have Vegapunk looking at Luffy and he basically explains that uh, the Devil Fruit is uh, the hope of and dreams of people and uh, for this they have to sacrifice and they cannot uh, they go against the water, Mother Nature. It was fate! Is the appearance of a god. Sun god. Nah, <laughs> Sanchez. Luffy is an idiot. The god. Sun god. And makes people smile. Nika. Someone who resembled or could have been uh, Nika would have been Oden. Because Oden was like kind of an idiot too. Are a manifestation of people aspiration for human evolution. I want to be that, I want to be like that, I want to be like this. And the different power represent a diverse future of humanity. And to that, her naturalness com comes with the punishment of being loaded by Mother Nature, the sea. Look how beautiful this animation. Boom. I don't understand if Luchus got conquer or not. Why it's even? Because they got both get pushed away. So I guess Luchus got conquer as well. CP0 Even this part where the Kuma turns around and attacks them is cool
Boing. Turns around. Boing. Really cool. Now this is the order of the elders. Look, I wouldn't have chosen any other different color. White is good. Poor. It's cool that everything is coming all together, like a king getting a, like abduct, how do you say abducted, jailed by a prisoner of the world government because they created this. Probably all his race was used to create these things. This saga again that everything happens in between is the best. With Garp uh, here in the island, it's like uh, the peak of One Piece. We are learning so many things. The only thing left to learn is uh, who Black Beard is, if he's like a Xebec clone or son or something like that. What kind of devil fruit he's got as well. So many stuff. Oh. Let's see what we see in the next episode. Uh, pfft, next episode is some trash uh, flashback. Well, I guess they are catching up too fast the anime, so they have to do something about it. Well, this was the episode. Amazing, amazing, really good. Well, let me know in the comment section what do you think about this beautiful episode. And uh, I'll see you. I'll see you soon. Maybe not. Who knows? But I'll see you. Hopefully, if the world doesn't end.